Turkey for Baba. to go see what? Sludge Mummies, episode two, Attack of the Bone. But you didn't even see the first movie. Only because you wouldn't take me. Hello, you were three? Myrtle gets to see PG movies. Her mom goes with her. Oh, and if Myrtle's mom jumped off a cliff, I suppose you'd want me to do that too. Wow, would you? No, there'll be no cliff jumping and no sludge zombie movies. They're sludge mummies. Whatever. <clears throat> Lila, look. I got work to do. I said no movie. And I mean no movie. This is a picture of us never getting to do anything fun. There's nothing worse in the world than being young. I mean, what good is it? Unless maybe you're a puppy at the pound, because nobody ever adopts the old dogs. They just adopt the puppies. That's what the shelter lady said when we went to adopt you. But aside from that, being young just totally... Hey, that head, those tan lines. I've seen them before. It's Sunburned Ice Cream Tourist. But now he's a baby? Jumbo! Yes, it is very same human. Without doubting, this is work of experiment 151. From the Civic Disturbances series? Yes. The idea was to turn entire populations into babies. Eh? With no grown-uppers around to babysit little tightlings, whole planets are turning into bawling, squalling, unsupervised chaos! <laughs> Much like Jumbo Family Dinner Table. <laughs> I miss those days. So, what do we do about him? Eh, effects eventually wear off on their own. When? 18 to 21 years, depending on state and local ordinances. 18 to 21 years? We'll all be mummified by then. There is one other solution. Special growing up formula that reverses 151's effects. Unfortunately, it's impossible to create formula. Why? New 2.0 computer refuses to read old 1.0 files. Piece of let's go. Too bad Jumbo's computer is on the blink. We don't even know what 151 looks like. I get better. That's gotta be it. Go get him. Cousin? your little friend Lilo. Lilo, over here. Mom, don't. Do you want to see sludge mummies with us? We've got an extra seat. Mom, that seat is for our purses. Right, girls? Yeah. No, thanks, Mrs. Myrtle's mom. I got an alien in my backpack, and we've really got to get home quick to have it genetically redesigned. 
Oh, yes, I see. It can't stay here on Earth unless it learns to channel its destructive impulses. Yes, exactly. Oh, great. Weird Low's making your mom into a Weird Low, too. Lilo! I told you no Sludge Mummy movies. Nani? But I... I didn't... Didn't think I'd come by and check. Well, you were wrong. Uh... <laughs> oh, trouble coming. I can't believe you disobeyed me. I said you couldn't see that movie. How come you're always telling me what to do? Because I'm the older sister here. I'm the babysitter. I am not a baby, and you're not an adult. You're just a grown-up. Whatever. I'm responsible for you, Lilo. That means I'm all about what's best for you. So what I say goes. You mean like a dictator? Go to your rooftop dome. I'm already there. <laughs> Stupid head, Nani. She gets to tell us what to do just because she's older. If only I was older than her, then we could go see Attack of the Bones. little winged abomination? No! Leave it alone, you big dummy! Oh? And who's going to stop me, little girl? You and your infant army? <laughs> oh, this was the easiest one ever. Being the bigger sister takes. I don't know how you do it. Know what that would be? 
That's right. Child endangerment. I'd be the worst bigger sister there ever was. So get your honey over here and look after these babies so I can save the genetic mutants and find the one place it truly belongs. And we can all live happily ever. Hello? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> baby-making experiment? Hey, aren't humans capable of doing that all by themselves? No, no, no. It turns grown-ups into babies. Really? Huh? Yes, babies. Hmm, hey, I'm feeling a little peckish. How about making me a... Hey, how'd you get up? Sorry, gee, I couldn't resist. I always wondered if you started out like a guppy or a tadpole. Turns out, you were just a smaller kind of ugly. Oh! Aerial attack! Did my hamster eyes just see what I thought they saw? This step of yet another valuable experiment? And why are you acting like a baby, you incompetent lady, also smelly, fish footed? Hey, lighten up, Dr. H, will ya? Little Hugo -goo here hasn't had his nap yet. No, 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 no. There will be no napping at the baby. I want my experiments. So get going. Go, go, go. No, no, no. Oh, no. You're supposed to be at work right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm supposed to be the responsible adult. What would a responsible adult do? Call in sick. Jumba, stop playing with Jumba's computer. You'll break it. <laughs> Hello? Rainbow Pavilion? Is Mr. Jameson there? <laughs> Mr. Jameson? Are you okay? I want my mom. <gasps> 151 must have gotten away from Camp Hill. It's turning more people into babies. <laughs> uh, I can't do this. I can't take care of a whole island of babies. <laughs> Jamba, I told you not to. Hey, you found the recipe to make everyone their normal age again. But how'd you fix the computer? <laughs> Evil genius child prodigy. Okay, one cup of milk, three mashed bananas, two teaspoons applesauce, and what? A dollop of 100% Kona coffee? But you gotta be an adult to buy that. Okay, everyone, just please behave for like five minutes. All we need is some 100% Kona coffee to get everyone back to normal. Here we go. Excuse me, could you buy me some 100% Kona coffee? I've got the money for it. Sorry, kid, you have to be 21 to buy the hard stuff. Um, I know. It's just, I left my ID at home. And I've got these four babies. Honey, let's just go. Baby Prodigy has a plan. <laughs> Careful, little Goo Goo. Don't hurt the poor innocent slide. You okay? Yeah. Jumba, I don't suppose you invented a baby fire catcher, did you? Jumba? Oh, no. I forgot the babies. Too many peoples. Must clear room somehow. Oops. Wow. Wow. 
little goo goo's worn herself out. Yes, he has. Time for nappy wappies. Rock a hula, <laughs> baby. Ah, little girl. You're back to normal. Yes. We obtained final ingredient for baby cure recipe. The big batch. Yeah, it was so tasty. I was seconds to boy, do I feel great, awake, strong, and energetic, but not jittery at all. No, no, no. Whoa! Is that the time already? Remember how to use this? Again. Being responsible is hard. <laughs> yeah, but it can be pretty satisfying when you raise a good kid. I am pretty good, huh? Yep. In fact, I want to reward you for being babysitter for a day. Let's go see some sludge mummies. Attack of the bones? Really? Yeah. I kind of forgot what it was like to be a kid. Now I remember. When you gotta see a scary movie, you gotta see a scary movie. But we're not taking that thing with us. So do your finding its one real place or whatever it is you do, and let's get going. Let's see here. What's the one place where being really young is a good thing? Puppies, Puppies at, at the pound. pound. Meet you at the movies later. Why the pound? Don't ask me, but you know what I never noticed before is how wide I can open my eye. Look, that's pretty good, huh? That's like so incredibly open. I bet I can see through solid lid. Old Mr. Patterson has been waiting for someone to adopt him for months. I'm afraid his time here is just about up. We can fix that. Ooh, that's a cuppa. That's a cuppa. Mommy, look at this one. I want this one. Baby hotline? Yeah, hi. Hiya, purple large shark-like alien baby. No, this isn't a joke. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Don't hang up. Oh, Blitz neck. Friday. They thought they had the perfect plan until reality got in the way. Watch Disney Channel's newest original movie, Pixel Perfect. It opens Friday at 8, 7 central here on Disney Channel.